Hello, first graders. Welcome to Grammar. It's Miss Fire. Today we are going to continue our conversation about super sentences. Last time we met, we talked about what a super sentence is. A super sentence is an important skill to have as writers. In a super sentence, there is a when, an adjective, a subject, a verb, and a where. So I want to play a little game before we get started. It's called, is it a super sentence? Again, it should have a when, an adjective, subject, verb, and where. So when I read the sentence, if it is a super sentence, I want you to stand up. If it's not a super sentence, then you can sit down. All right, let's look at number one play outside. Is that a super sentence? I hope you're sitting down because that is not a super sentence. Who's playing outside? Where are they playing outside? When are they playing outside? It's missing a lot of those components to a super sentence. Let's look at the next one. This morning, my younger brother wanted to play outside in the garden. Hmm, is this a super sentence? I hope you're standing up. This is a super sentence. Hmm, when? This morning. The adjective, younger. The subject of our sentence. Who are we talking about in our super sentence? It's the brother. The verb is play. And where is our subject um, playing? outside in the garden. Fantastic. All right, let's look on, look at the next sentence. The gigantic puddle. Hmm, is this a super sentence? I hope you're sitting down. It is not a super sentence. We are missing some of those components. Hmm, how could I make this a super sentence? Think about that, first graders. How might I make the gigantic puddle a super sentence? If you have an idea, shout it out now. All right, let's look at the next sentence. Number four, I jumped into the gigantic puddle after the rainstorm. Hmm, is this a super sentence? It is. I hope you're standing up. It looks like we took number three, which was not a super sentence, added some of those components we were missing, and made a super sentence. All right, let's look at our last one here. Got soaking wet. Is that a super sentence? You are right. It is not. So I hope you are sitting down. Okay, first graders, what I would like us to do next because after you're done watching our video here, you can print out this worksheet from our PowerSchool learning page. It says, make it a super sentence. The directions, turn each simple sentence into a super sentence. Hint, remember the five important components of a super sentence. When, adjective, subject, verb, where. Number one, our simple sentence, sentence is, the sand is hot. Hmm. Think about that. How can we make that simple sentence a super sentence? It has some parts of a super sentence, but it's missing a few. Number two, I saw a dog. Hmm. Think about the missing components and how we can turn that into a super sentence. And then number three, the man is happy. Hmm, how can we make that a super sentence? And then once I'm done and I have three super sentences on my paper, I need to check my work. Did I start with a capital letter and end with an ending punctuation? Because that is also very important when I am making any kind of sentence, but especially a super sentence. All right, first graders, you can get started. Happy writing.